This has been my travel companion. Missouri, Wyoming, Oregon, Washington, Notre Dame, Penn State, Texas A&M, Oregon State, Stanford, Louisville, UCLA, Michigan State, USC. I believe those are goalposts. Oregon State should continue its upward trajectory in 2017, but their record might not reflect it. In his third year, Coach Gary Anderson continues to build the foundation that he values, and that is old school, big bodied, smash mouth, line of scrimmage football. This year he'll have a couple of 330 pound defensive tackles to make piles in the middle of that front seven, and an active group of linebackers that can do a lot of damage there if those guys can hold their own. The offensive line continues to get bigger and stronger. And this year, they'll be blocking for one of the most deep and talented groups of running backs in the Pac-12, led by Ryan Nall and TCU transfer Travoris Johnson. But there are two issues. The first is quarterback. Last year, they just couldn't stay healthy there, and so they're not quite certain what they have at that position going into 2017. The other is the schedule. How's this for a brutal stretch? Minnesota, Washington State, Washington, USC, Colorado, Stanford. Then a couple of weeks later, they travel to Oregon to face an angry bunch of ducks that they beat last year here in Corvallis. That's the first time in about a decade that Oregon State won the Civil War. That's a rough schedule. So fans should, yes, watch the scoreboard. Yes, expect wins. But in addition to that, look at the trenches because a few years ago, Oregon State got pushed around inside. Then they started to hold their own. This is the year that they expect to start pushing back themselves.